songs for you this evening, so, you know, be, um, <laughs> be good to me. <laughs> um, and the first one is um, a song uh, made famous uh, by the lovely Doris Day. <laughs> Ten cents a minute. Oh 
system and fabulous events and entertainment and royalty and just a stunning evening and we are thrilled tonight to have the Serena with us, Liz Lauren, and she's going to tell us about the Harvey Milk Foundation. Let's hear it ladies and gentlemen. The Serena is on. Actually, is our archduchess in the Imperial Court System for Public Schools. And Taya and I live together, so all those rumors <laughs> are true. <laughs> 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 so, the, every morning I get up and have tea, and I keep thinking of Lindsay Patterson from Prince. Oh, is it Patterson or Peterson? Peterson. Peterson. That's an odd name for a lesbian. Peter said, Peter, Peter, you got my letter. Who's in my drawers again? How could you stoop so low? And I listened to her read hers. And I have to say something about this lovely Canadian superstar, accomplished actress, the next mile straight. She has heart like you wouldn't believe. She worried so much about coming here to please Palm Springs. She really cares. And she puts a lot of joy in performances. So another half for Taylor. Now, another half for yourselves, because as Bella said, on August 7th, the Riviera Ballroom, the first diversity, not drag, not gay, but diversity ball was held. It, it never had been done before. We had something for everybody. We had old people, young people working together on the stage, retired Broadway stars, local Palm Springs stars, and young up-and-coming Hollywood stars. It was absolutely, well, I, I didn't even get to go to my own ball because I was backstage crying most of the time. Anyway, I got a letter, in the letter thing, I got a letter from uh, Stuart Milk, himself a couple of days ago and he congratulated Palm Springs for the biggest donation this year so far for the Harvey Love Foundation. So give us a 